can see down. All right, guys, welcome back. So we're gonna start out uh, looking for some sea snakes, and then we're gonna go out today, look for some more uh, nighttime stuff. Nighttime activity has been pretty much dead, but can't complain with this amazing scenery. We'll see if we can find some more sea snakes today. Um, can we do better than four? We'll see, you ready? Is the type of plastic looking like a jellyfish That's sea turtle a sea turtle, turtle killer gotta get more trash I got you. Ugh. all right guys it's a little harder today because there's a lot of chop coming in the slicks farther out that's a stick. Sorry, it's a stick. There's a lot of fish in here too. Look at them down there. Yeah. We're just gonna work and see what we can find. The water's like clear today, but choppier. Yeah. All right, let's stay. Oh, there's one, there's one. Right there, right there, right there. I got it! I got him! Come back! No, come back! There we got we go. one, guys. We're good hop about in with it? Yeah. Hop yeah. in with it in the shot. He's that way. I'll watch him. <laughs> Two sea snakes already. Huh? There you go. Uh, that was an eagle ray, I believe. I don't know. It's cool either way. I don't know the species. It's just awesome out here. The water feels great. Just floating around. We saw a couple sharks earlier. Yeah. There's a sea snake on me. That kept happening yesterday because it hit my leg. The only bad thing about today is there's zillions of baby jellyfish in the water all stinging us constantly, but it's it's not too bad. Ow, ow, get me out. Ow, 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 ow. Jellies. Giant bait pod. Let's go see what's in it. Look at them. They're going crazy. So beautiful out. All right, let's keep moving around and see what we can find. Can I try? Yeah. Oh, look at, we're burnt. Look at, well, most of me. <laughs> How are you not burnt? I have darker skin. I finally got a little bit of a suntan. Okay, guys, so we are gonna hit the road, which we're already doing, so whatever. But it is finally raining. I mean, it's just about a couple drops, but we're the gonna take. Wet. It's been raining. We're gonna take what we could get. Brett, you've been saying that for days. The road just looks wet. It's not wet. Have you touched I have it? Hopeful, I have hopeful have eyes. You touched, I have hopeful eyes. Have you touched? Hold on, scratch my nose. Have you touched the road? No, it's probably dry. So we're gonna see what we can scrounge up. We're driving about an hour to a different national park to see if that's been burnt up as much as the area we're staying in. We're hoping not. It's just very devastating seeing all the habitat just burnt to a crisp and knowing all those animals are probably also burnt to a crisp oh, like yeah. a barbecue. There's no way they survive. Yeah. So wish us luck. We're wishing ourselves luck and let's see what we can show you. And this is why the side of the country is burning because they have a huge issue right now with burning and the government's like please stop burning and the people are like nah we're gonna keep doing it. That side caught fire. Why are you still burning? Why? <laughs> Is it calling my name? Should we go down it's there? It's not on the map. It's not on the map? Mm -mm. 
So our last day in Costa Rica, I promised Taylor we would set up, we'd find some monkeys and have some lunch with them. There's capuchins all around us. I'm trying to get them in the camera. They were sitting over the street, but they've moved. Oh, there's a whole, it's a big troop. So we'll get some footage of them at some point. Oh, there's a little baby up, up like right, right there. He's up there. So lunch with the monkeys. Huh? Oh, look at the doing her happiness as well, eating. See, I knew this was monkey happy time. I said, hi, little guy. He's being real cute. He's like, mmm, that ceviche looks good. Do you want my food? I'm not feeding you. Hmm? Hmm, he's getting mad at me. Every time I focus on what it goes. Is this romantic or what? This is this is romantic. I don't, I don't care what anyone says. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look, a family of quaddies came out while we're watching the monkeys. Talk about dinner with a view. This is just so amazing. Oh, another. And another. Oh, it's a huge group of quaddies. He does. I don't know what he is, but he's huge. I can't. I don't. This has to be the biggest Costa Rican snake we've had. He's like a racer in a coach. He kept going for my face. I know. Look at him. Huh? He's, he's ready. Let's get him to calm down. See? Oh. He's, here, let me get some video. Oh, he's cool. Okay, Red, tell us about the snake. I have no idea what it is. Obviously, a terrestrial snake. It reminds me of a whip snake from Arizona. All I know is that was the fastest snake I ever had to catch in my life. This, or an, it, I think it was faster on the Eastern Coach Whip. You probably didn't get a video of it because we swerved around him, but I'm out of breath because I literally had to do a sane <laughs> bolt. Don't really want to. Oh, they're ticks. Ooh, we can pick them off. Oh. No, oh we're going to restrain gosh. him. She's got a big cluster of ticks. Sure. We're going to clean them up. Just... <laughs> Holy. Yeah, I don't want to, he's, dude, he'll, def, he'll definitely need stitches after this. See? And he might be rude. Yeah, he's like so, f***ing real thing, dude. Yeah. He's really f***ing He's, it's fine. We're going to have to get the foot and then, got it, see? Oh, how did you get him off of that? Uh, well, you just hold the body. He He's got some teeth Sir. There. Sir. All right, got him. He masked. Yeah, he stinks. Hold on. Okay, we normally don't grab snakes by the back of the head, but we're going very lightly. Taylor, show him the, we'll show him the scar from the bird eater because we sh we're showing in a previous video, but that's from a colubrid out here. She needed several stitches and we don't need a day with stitches because the colubrids here have got some serious teeth. Look at the ticks. Ooh, that's fun. Sure One that. thing to know about me, I'm a picker. I love picking ticks, blackheads, you name it. I'll pick it. And a lot of the uh, colubrids here, they do have venom. It's not often powerful, but like the bird eater on my hand was felt like being stung. Another one. Gotta kill the ticks as you get them off. Is it wound? Is that bone? No, I'm just kidding. You're right up, buddy. Hold on. He has more. It's more ticks. Mm-hmm. Okay, guys, that was really cool catching a really big colubrid. He's huge. Um, Rick got bit. So far, he's been good, so we should be fine. Yeah. We don't know what he is still. 
Uh, we got some of the ticks off and he's obviously a healthy, sturdy snake. So we're gonna let him go now. Look at this thing. He's well over six feet. Look at the hay bales. We have seen so many rodents and birds. If surprise, this is the first snake we got in this area. This is about where I caught him. Okay. That's how far I had to run. To, that's how oh, fast okay. he was. Look, my tracks are right there. Hi. All right, ready? You let him go. Go, by go. Okay. Oh, he's gonna pose. Heck yeah, look at that. He's a cool looking snake. He almost has like a cobra face. Some kind of oh he just needed the grass team good work that was crazy hey guys we are back in the car for our final road cruise in costa rica because we leave in the morning <coughs> so today has been great we got the two sea snakes and we just caught that really cool colubra and got some ticks off it. So I got to do my little pimple popper there's, pick in. There's so much wildlife out today. It's great for our last yeah. day. Caracaras, we just saw a kawadi. Unfortunately, a lot of the stuff is kind of skittish out in these areas. Yeah, we keep trying to film stuff for you, but before we even kind of get close to it, the things are running. So, <laughs> oh my God, I'm like joking. So let's get to road cruising and see if we can continue this good luck streak. Oh, like when guys are like losing their hair so they're trying to slick back the bit that they have. I thought it was a turtle. Ah, uh, maybe get out the camera for a crab. Tisk tisk. Look at you looking like G.I. Jane with your machete. Tay Tay, what'd you get? I, with I just kicked a rock. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah, let's see that rock. Wow. Oh shit, hold on. Wait, another one? Oh no, I want to stick. Whoa, that is a huge I wish he'd stick out his head so we could figure out what he is. Yeah. For for us. It was just a weird rock. And then I was like, no, there's no rocks in here. Unfortunately, he's closed like a box turtle. Shaped like a mud turtle. I wish he'd pop out. We'll have to figure out what he is later, I guess. I'll let him go? Yeah, I'll let him go. Maybe he'll come out for us. He said in the shallow mm -hmm. water. He was right here. It's like zigzag. I think it's a giant, giant spilotes. It's a tiger rat snake? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A giant. Is that a spilotes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's a giant tiger rat snake. Actually not usually. Okay, so we just pulled a bunch of it out of the tree. The end of the shed is all the way down here. It is longer than you because it goes up past your head. That's like the halfway point. It's eight foot plus snake. Whoa, look at the poison glands on that cane toad. All right, guys, it's po it poured rain. There's toads all over the road. This is a species we have back home in Florida, uh, but they've got big poison glands that get people's dogs sick. They are native, however, to uh, Costa Rica. They're not native to Florida. Ooh, that's a big one too. Look at this, what an incredible find. This is a yellow toad. This is a species that only occurs over here on the dry coast, something I've been wanting to see for a while. Uh, what an excellent finder last night. <laughs> Look at him, he's trying to mate with me. This is so neat, guys. I've always wanted to see one of these, uh, and they are even more beautiful in person. They look like they've been spray painted. So awesome. What a cool find. Hey, bud. All right, come back. No, I love you. You get back to your farmland, sir. You're one of them bad teenagers, aren't you? Okay, bud, have a good night, okay? Yeah. Bye. Our common snake of the trip, cat-eyed snake playing in the road. Pretending to be venomous. Come on, go. Okay. I don't want to pick up your stinky eye. Okay, guys, we started this series on a beach and we're gonna end it on a beach. Beautiful. You can't see it, but no. it's there. I think this is, what, our sixth trip to Costa No, but fifth trip to Costa Rica together or something? Fifth trip together and my eighth trip. Yeah, so highly recommend Costa Rica for all you newbies uh, going out internationally. It's a great country. It is. It's a fantastic country. Food's everywhere. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's safer than the U.S. and most yeah. of it. So, all right, so, guys. We hope, hope you enjoyed the series. 
see you back in Florida.